I'm a board certified oncology pharmacist and I work at UC Davis Medical Center in Sacramento, California. I oversee our oncology pharmacy services both in the hospital and at the outpatient cancer center. Oncology pharmacists play a really significant role in ensuring that patients understand how to take their medications, which days of the week or month to take their medications. They also do follow up with the patients to ensure that they are taking their medications, and then they help make adjustments in collaboration with the physicians to um, the doses or by adding medications to help patients tolerate the meds uh, and manage toxicities. One thing that board certification does is it, is it does assure a minimum level of competence. It also requires that you have a certain level of practice, practice experience as a pharmacist before you can even qualify to take an examination. So as an employer, when you're hiring a pharmacist that's board certified, you know that they have met those rigorous criteria to sit for the examination and also have a minimum level of practice experience in that specific setting. In my experience, oncology pharmacists play a pretty significant role as an advocate for the patient to ensure that, that the regimen that they are being prescribed are being prescribed with the ultimate safety. So uh, I have a great example of a story with a patient um, at our cancer center investigational drugs pharmacy. Uh, this was a patient who um, about six years ago started on a clinical trial with an oral medication to treat lung cancer and he celebrated his sixth anniversary um, of being on this therapy and, and with his disease being in remission. And just the other day I saw him and he pulled a wallet out of his pocket and showed me pictures of his grandchildren whom he wouldn't have met had he not been on this trial. But he wrote us all a letter in, in which he thanked us, the investigational drugs pharmacists at the cancer center for um, constantly providing him with his medications and following up to make sure that he knew how to take his medications. BPS board certification helps me personally because it's an, an additional credential that adds credibility to my own experience and practice as a pharmacist. It makes me feel proud that I have that credential that I can include with my name and, and demonstrate to others that not only do I have these years of practice, but I also have a certification in oncology pharmacy. I think in the coming years, we're going to have a bit of a gap between oncologists and the number of patients with cancer. And so pharmacists in, in this role as advanced practice providers will be able to pick up some of the, the slack where there may not be enough oncologists to manage all of these patients. By working collaboratively, we can become a physician extender.